and gentlemen, it is about that time um, the gnarly vlog is gonna be released. That being said, like anything gnarly beast fashion and nothing going to plan, this is your intro because I am still finishing and editing the vlog. However, the intro that I shot, Kay wasn't home, I panicked. Um, it was ridiculous. I, I had salt all over the place. I didn't know what I was doing. I'm gonna keep that in here, but I wanted you guys to start off with something a little different. So what's the gnarly beast vlog? Well, let me tell you. We have RC cars, we have bikes, we have new bike shops. We might even have sharks in tents, tigers, airplanes jumping out of them. Jet fighters, F-16s, a lot of this hasn't happened, but it might get gnarly. Tune in. Okay. Uh, oh, that's salt. Okay. This angle doesn't make sense, but I am your host, Connor. All of that was whack. I'm going to try that again. But I am Connor. My other half, Kay, is not here with me. She is in Georgia with our little one, Lennon. Yes, I do my own hair. Peep it. Sometimes. Okay, so it is uh, Wednesday. It's just Hey Dog and I here today. Still trying to determine if we're gonna open the shop on Monday, and like that's not a running joke. We're, we're gonna see, but like we don't have the paint to finish the floor, like to finish and touch up. We still gotta do a lot of trim, staining, some admin work, so I just brought my laptop over. We do have um, internet now in the new building, so I can work from over here, and then Hey just touched up the suspension line, but look. Today. That looks fun. See what? what do you have over there for us? Are we so, checking? Oh, dude, that's so sick. Okay, so update, it is now five o'clock. Um, Hayden and I are about to go over to the station to have some fun. We've been grinding out um, in the new bike shop for a while. One thing I will say, when I walk into the room, when I walked in this morning, I think I was a little overwhelmed with how much I thought had to get done, but just simply putting down the strip um, of that black rubber right there, and then touching up all the paint already makes everything look really cool. We're gonna put a second layer of paint on the floor again tonight. Uh, Hill found two gallons last night. She had to go like five for Home Depots. Um, Hayden's doing his thing. Okay, so uh, now we're over bag session. We have two jumpers here with us today. Oh, there they are. Some no-handers. Some backflips going on. Uh, we have another hour left of bag jumping, so I'm actually gonna get this whole music set up dialed in. Okay, so it is Thursday. Um, the shop, we are still thinking Monday or Tuesday we're gonna open. Probably Monday we'll do the final link touches and then uh, Tuesday we'll open up. Hayden and I, oh, there's Hayden. We are moving all of this stuff um, to the new shop with the intention of getting it as ready as it can be. 11 to 10, but you know what? It's gonna make me stronger. Oh, time to go on the thing. Oh no, this is... So, um, it's actually a lot more than we thought. It's not only my truck, it's also going to be um, Hayden's. So that's pretty cool. Uh, it's been a really cool day. We're super stoked. Hild has no idea what I'm about to hit her with. Um, I, I told her I was coming with some stuff to start, and I'm bringing her two truck pulls. So, Hill, when you're watching this, I, I, I knew that was an issue. Oh, these full faces, too. All right. Cheers. Here's Nick. What's up with it? Okay, so pulling out a Taco Bell. The universe has been well, so we're getting treated today. It is Taco Bell day. We're getting over to the station to do some work. Taco Bell, let's go. What time did the person sign up for? No, I have no idea. But someone called in saying, like, I'm going to learn how to not shit my pants. I'm in the air. And he's like, drop the road station. Um, 50 hour um, rebuild 
don't air sleep. So if you see air sleep, it's gonna be hour. That's the thing you should do with this, not doing the damper body, but just the air sleep. Fox and Rock Shock are different companies, so that's pure shock. So you would never do like an air sleep rebuild the fork, that's just not a thing. So that's shock. Okay, about to head to the airport to get Kay and Lennon. Um, wow, dope. Um, Hill and I dominated today. Uh, we used up every single hook, so 400 items somehow got hung on the wall. Um, the tires still have to happen, the tubes. That'll come after Cord builds the cubbies on Friday. We're still waiting on some of our longer um, pegboard hooks to come in. Uh, so thinking probably opening more realistically around Tuesday or Wednesday for that reason. Okay, oh. it is Friday. I am at the station. I'm actually at the station, Northwest. And then I'm gonna go um, to the other bike shop and then come back here for advanced bag session. And I'm pretty positive Dio and I are gonna build his DJ, um, his dirt jumper during um, the advanced bag session. So one thing that's really neat, we used to give out water bottles. Everyone drank half water bottles, which we expected. But now look at this, we have actual water. We have hot water, cold water. And then is the heat real? Like is the red actually gonna be heated or is it yeah. Wow. Um, the station today, Cord is actually back, so he's gonna be doing a lot of the woodworking, so I'm gonna be over there. Um, I'm gonna, we'll record our briefings, we're gonna go through some things together, and then he's gonna get started, I'm gonna leave. Um, Cord's gonna be over there to assist him, do some staining, some sanding. He's also gonna do some inventory. So we have all of this stuff that needs to go into the other bike shop, so that's what he's gonna work on. And then yeah, we'll take care of this thing. Friday, Cord is back. I'm gonna keep continually saying it, I'm super excited. I think what he's really gonna work on is this. Bring you around. This, this is our workbench. Like the two-man team, I mean, that's what an incredible workbench this is. He's doing incredible work. This is where a double stand's gonna be. It's gonna sit right in here. That way we're gonna be able to get definitely two bikes on it. All our miraculous tools will be on this tool wall. We just ordered that today. That's what we're thinking Wednesday of an opening. Um, but we wanna have everything staged. Tuesday, we wanna do like a dress rehearsal. Check this out, entire hope wall. Entire hope wall. Every part you would ever need. All team green, your color, some rotors. We have some absolute black. Here's gonna be all of our brake pads, our chains, our rotors, all of your different things you need to work on your bike or that we would need to work on a bike is gonna be right behind us. So hey, that's the goal for today. Let's see what happens. I'm super stoked. It's getting early. Um, Corey's picking up a lot of the, he's actually doing some touch-up paint around the black trim. Hill is inventorying the Hope stuff. Corey's in there building, doing whatever he's doing. I am trying to get the phones to work. So some of our um, internet ports are just, they're just hollow because they did some work in the shops. So you see like right there. So we're pretty positive this one works. We're also gonna paint this and eventually replace the wood once we are no longer poor. Um, but until then, we're just gonna use this. This is, look at this, look, look at this nice little like um, extra. Yeah, right there. So we're gonna paint that, try and get the phones working. Still thinking we're gonna open Wednesday. Parts don't come in, the new tools don't come in for the new shop until Wednesday. So we're gonna grab them from the station on Tuesday, bring them here, and then when the tools come in, we'll take them to the station. So hey, another day in the gnarly world. Get gnarly. Mm -hmm. Hello? Okay. <laughs> okay, it is Friday night. We're at the advanced bag session. Get the bag up right now, okay? We got, I think, 10 jumpers here. Um, we're gonna build Dio's bike, so he's getting a dirt jumper today. Um, we broke the mini Jeep, 
so I just decommission that until the spring. We do not have the money to fix that. So the mini Jeep is down for the count. Um, we're going to build a bike today, and then um, we're going to do some nasty tricks. Diego invited his friend Nick, so he's here for the first time. We're going to see what he's throwing down. Um, my hair's a mess. I'm going to throw the camera in and just have a good time. I'm done for the day. It's party. where you slam your shin yeah because you're gonna land short if anything but you're so past committing now Dio's stomping out the back. The homies are here. The fire pit's going. The airbag's going. All right. Let's see if they want any more. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Got to get up here and not break my wrist. All right. So it is Saturday. It is my favorite day of the week. Uh, we have six beginner jumpers here today um, for the beginner and instructional lesson. Um, Cord is running an absolutely incredible um, class. He's actually, I think, uh, oh, there he is. So Cord was outside, we had one more late bloomer, so he was bopping out to catch them up. We start our beginner class outside on little ramps, and then we come on inside to start jumping on the bag. Not actual the bag, but uh, you know. Like, oh. I keep saying it but we're like pretty ecstatic about these uh topeak toolkits um so this is a sales pitch because this is sick um this is a thousand dollars but it is literally stocking our entire new bike shop but i'm just flabbergasted because if i was ever an at-home mechanic like it has everything tort like everything i mean it doesn't have a drill or alignment tool like plus 100 bucks you have the whole thing but we're talking this is rivaling kits that i've seen that are five thousand dollars i am not tied into topeak i could care less I don't even know if I'll post this video, but like we're gonna start pushing it. It's a blast. It has everything. I'm gonna put this on a time lapse and show you. I'm gonna build the entire wall. It's nuts. Gnarly. Look at this thing. Boom. <laughs> So some Saturday nights we'll just jump on in. So right now, if I can turn it as well, you have Cord, Hill, and Kay over there. Cord's giving some instruction, and Kay and Hill are just hitting some repetition with Ethan right now. Um, Ethan's probably gonna go for a no tuck, no hander. Called it.
more time i didn't like what i was doing with my hands okay no wait. just one more time now do we want it that close to your face or do you want guys we got to hang up a temporary sign that's actually the back of our tent and we're going to climb this ladder that is on rocks and then we're going to climb to the very very top that use that ladder to go all the way up there and i'm going to do this with a broken wrist let's get gnarly all right here we go Oh, it goes taller. We're okay. It oh, goes taller. Right. No, it's safe mode. Even safe mode. Taller, it's even safer. All right, cool. All right, so we're on top of our shop. It's cold out. I got my friends here. We got our temporary banner. This is actually the backside of our tent. Shout out Clayton Peterson for the connection to Black Squirrel. Cool. Look. Down there. All right, so our plan is to somehow cool, thank you. get over this. Yeah, oh, man, this is talks. actually more brutal than I thought. So we're gonna get the ladder. We're gonna put it against this, and then Cor's gonna do, and then oh, and then I can just hold the ladder so it doesn't slide. Cor's gonna put probably the ladder up there. Yeah. Um, and then we're gonna hang on the back side. We're gonna do some 550 cord. We can probably tie into these things right here. And the good thing up. is this is only temporary. Here, so we're bring it down first. Bring it down here. Mm -hmm. No, too, wait too short. Bring it down. Oh, no, it's way too tall. Bring it down. It's way too tall, but we're just gonna bring it down. That's why it's an adjustable guy. This roof is a little squishy, but... I'm going to look at our windows. Our windows are dirty. Jim, what the hell? Well, I think you hired Clayton. <laughs> True. Clayton, get up here. Yeah, let me go check on the tattoo shop, see what they're doing in here. What are you boys doing in here? Hello? Yo, Jim. What's up, Jim? Hey, Jim, you in there? Just go on down the line. Say, what up to these apartments? What's up, guys? Yo, what's up, Nolly Bees? You're looking good down there. What's up? What do you do? Oh, Cord needs light. Sorry. There we go. Good down there. Oh, there goes Cord. But he seems so confident. Dude, Cord's locked in. Yeah. We're fine. No fear. All right. How do we spot Cord so we can die, though? this one is even less sketchy. <laughs> oh, my God. This up. is there. You are. Oh, my God. Super easy. Oh, I'm I don't have to get super far up there. I just have to be able to lace it. Yeah, I'm oh, holding the ladder. Man, I want to do the sketchy shit. No, I'm just kidding. All right, so what are this. The, oh, these are already. Look at these rope hooks already mounted. That's, they're not rope hooks. They're snow breaker uppers. Oh, snow, yes. I thought they're badass rope hooks. I'm like, who the fuck is All right, Cord, we're going nowhere. I'm holding on to this with my non broken <laughs> hand. Come up here first. We have to tie these off. Oh. So that I can lace it over. Do we, have, do we have actual metal grommets? Yeah, we fuck, we don't. No, we have, we have the sewn in. Gentlemen, that's a wrap. We're gonna open tomorrow, Wednesday. That is a wrap. Good night.